Senny, I'm currently the uh, Senior Vice President of uh, Pricing, Marketing and Partnerships and I also have quite a bit of involvement in managing key accounts and customer care. And in terms of your relationship with your e-commerce cu customers, can you expand on the services you offer and what benefits they gain from working with you? Yeah, I mean, relationships are absolutely the forefront of um, how we work with e-commerce companies. They're, there's, there's, they're all different. I mean, there are companies that want to send high value goods and speed is their driver. You know, there's companies that might want to send low value apparel or t-shirts or something like that. And it's really all about cost. So we need to listen and adapt to them. Uh, our sales team is trained at um, listening to what their needs are and then adapting and, and fitting uh, the right service, whether it's, um, uh, you know, a three to five day delivery or it's a seven to 14 day delivery. It really depends on what that customer really needs. Um, we also have uh, quarterly, uh, what we call quarterly business reviews that our sales team and key account managers do where we're sitting with our e-commerce customers and understanding, not just reviewing past performance, uh, but looking at what uh, they might be looking to in the future. Uh, it's really, really productive time that we spend with the customer. Much of that right now is clearly virtual, but it's still productive. But really an important thing we do is um, communicate. We really believe in a, in a robust communication plan. And that's not just externally with customers. Um, it's also internally with employees. Uh, but externally with the e-commerce customers right now, with all the change going on in the world, uh, and all of the, the COVID updates and service um, updates, it's really important to over-communicate and we believe that's very important and it builds trust and credibility as well. Lovely, thank you for that, Gary. Um, and finally, in, in terms of the key trends or technologies pertinent to your business that will contribute to how you shape your relationship with e-commerce companies, can you maybe expand on those key trends? Um, you know, the trend really is going to continue to be what it's been, which is that, you know, companies want faster, more transparent, more convenient delivery at economical pricing. Um, and, and that's what Ascendia needs to continue to offer to e-commerce companies. Um, another trend, which will really become important in 2021, is e-commerce companies are starting to realize that it's a better customer experience if they offer landed cost solutions, which means basically when they go and shop in the shopping cart, it's, you know, the duties, the taxes, the shipping costs are all baked into one price and there's no surprises on the other end uh, at, at, the, at the country of destination with duties and taxes particularly. In 2021, uh, the EU will go, be going to a zero de minimis. So, you know, e-commerce companies really need to prepare for that to make sure their customers still maintain the same experience.